in contact. A few weeks after that, I was made aware that Lou had left the Pentagon in protest and joined forces with Tom DeLonge, Chris Mellon, Steve Justice, and others to form Two Stars Academy, an organization that pressed the issue with leading industry experts and U.S. government officials. They worked with Leslie Keene, who is present today, Ralph Blumenthal, and Helene Cooper to publish the articles in the New York Times 2017 uh, New York Times, and it removed the stigma on the topic of UFOs, which is why we're here today. Those articles open the door for the government and public that cannot be closed. It has led to an interest from our elected officials who are not focused on little green men, but figuring out where these craft are, where are they from, the technology they possess, how do they operate. It also led to the Whistleblower Protection Act and the NDAA. There are multiple witnesses coming forward to say uh, that have firsthand knowledge, and, and Mr. Grush just covered that. What concerns me is that there's no oversight from our elected officials on anything associated with our government processing or working on craft. Uh, believe not from this world. This issue is not a full public disclosure that can undermine national security, but it is about ensuring that our system of checks and balances works across all work done in the government using taxpayer funds.